This is the high density Espalier Gardener. And I had shown on a previous video that I had a tomato plant here. Um, but it was growing in a really funky way, so I took it out and I put two new um, little tomato plants. These are cherry tomatoes, little red ones. <clears throat> and I'm taking down a previous, that's why I started pointing this way. I'm taking down a previous little fence that I had put up. And I'm putting up a new fence, and you can see that over in the uh, other end. But uh, the stakes that I used on the other one, these, taking them all out, and instead of just tossing them because I'm not going to use them on that fence anymore, I decided to see if I could make them work with something else. So I've posted the plant, I mean, put these in at an angle. This one is not as much as of an angle as this one. But um, it's because it's too close to the chimney. But um, I put some strong nylon string between those little posts. So um, there's some pretty good tension on it. And I have these two little uh, cherry tomato plants. They have little uh, buds here. And... Uh, there you can see those and um, I'll be training those up against the wires I mean um, the strings up until they get that tall this height here and <clears throat> I'm going to try to treat them as just like I treat the rest of my espalier stuff I'm just going to make sure that they stay against the strings and we'll see how it goes these are my cherry tomatoes I'm going to be planting four other varieties of tomatoes, but the other ones are all big. Some uh, beefsteak and aromas and a couple others. And then um, I'm doing that so I can check to see which ones I like the best. Then I'll just grow those. Um, so that's why I'm trying four of them. But we already know we like these little cherry tomatoes. And, and these the little suckers give... Um, well, they're not suckers, but... <laughs> These little cherry tomato plants give uh, cherry tomatoes almost all year long. These are these are crazy. I don't know what variety it is, but they're really good and very productive. I'll post an update later once they're taller and have uh, fruit on them. If you have any questions or comments, please post them and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you for watching.